Following the mass murder of Igala people in Agojeju community of Omala local government area in Kogi State, the member representing the good people of Olama Boro, Omala and Angpa Federal Constituency, Honorable Ibrahim Alims, move a motion of national security emergency as a step towards finding solution to the problem of Heda's incessant killing in Omala local government area of Kogi State. Listen to Honorable Ibrahim Halims. Thank you, Your Excellency, the Right Honorable Speaker, distinguished Honorable colleagues. Once again, Honorable Abdullah Ibrahim Halims is my name. I am from Kogi State. And I represent the wonderful people of Angpa, Omala, Olamabara, Federal Constituency. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. I rise to move this very urgent need to avert security challenge that is happening in Otutubatu Chiefdom in Omala local government, Kogi State. Mr. Speaker, sir, the House knows that Otutubatu Chiefdom is an ancient kingdom founded by Ebutueje, the first Igala king and the founder of Atta dynasty in Igala kingdom in the, 20th, in the 12th century. Also note that Otutubatu chiefdom comprises of Bagana, Ogba, or Magede, all in present day Omara local government of Kogi state, is completely under siege due to the renewed attack by Hesmen since on Sunday, 18 February 2024 leading to destructions of lives and properties. What millions of Naira to the extent that the chief of the community narrowly escaped being killed through the whiskers. Further note that Otutubatu Chiefdom is a riverine community in Kogi State bordering Nasarawa State on one side and Benue State on the other side. Because of its strategic location on floodplain of rivers, River Benue, the, economic, the major economic occupation of the people in the area is farming and fishing. Worried that this community has suffered several attacks from herdsmen, stroke bandits, resulting to loss of lives and properties worth millions of naira, and the inhabitants are currently having refuge in the neighboring community, community schools. Disturbed that the magnitude of the renewed attack and losses is huge, if nothing is done drastically to address this challenge, the whole community will be wiped out of the state and by extension affect food production in the state. Also disturbed is that taking away the livelihood of the inhabitants, especially this period of hardship, is equally as good as taking away life from them. The house resolved all the Inspector General of Police and Services and Service Chiefs to constitute a, a joint tax force to immediately evacuate the militant from this community for peace to reign. Prayer number two. All the Chief of Naval Staff and Inspector General of Police to establish a naval base and police station in the community to enforce maintenance of peace in the community. Number three. All national emergency agency to provide relief materials for the displaced person in the community. Number four, all the, the, all the committees on Navy, Police, NEMA, and Legislative Compliance to ensure compliance. Number five, to observe a minute silence for the bereaved. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Any second to say aye? Those against you say nay. The eyes of it. This motion is referred to the committees on Navy, Police, and NEMA for further legislative actions. The bill by Honorable Halims have been seconded and referred to the appropriate committees for further action. This is what a leader should do and not just sitting in a place to issue a press statement to, uh, that will amount to nothing. Thank you, Honorable Halims.